welcome to my channel my name is Shanae Braxton and I'm a travel and lifestyle content creator today you can find me in Las Vegas I'm here for the grow with video live conference hosted by the think media team and I'm super super excited to learn all that I can about YouTube business strategy and also I'm excited to connect with other creators that use YouTube as a platform to grow and market their businesses Gary V will be here presenting Vanessa Lau Aaron on demand and so many other impactful creators and I'm so excited to learn from all of them come along with me for the next two days as I experience the grow with video live conference welcome to grow with video live 2022 are you excited we're on our first break and we just heard from Sean Kennel Heather Torres and Vanessa Lau so many golden nuggets Vanessa talked about starting growth and scaling I identify myself in the growth phase because I have been thinking about the strategies now that I need to put in place the systems that I need to put in place so that I can start to build greater consistency because I feel like I'm in the right place at the right time and making progress there's a lot more for me to learn there are a lot more ways for me to reinvent myself reinvent my channel what mention my course and I just talk about some of the slides that I'm working on or some of the things that I'm doing in it I see an increase in sales. How long have you been in the club? For two years now I actually joined the club when I was living in Morocco and I was deciding to start a YouTube channel. You actually gave me the, the encouragement and just inspired me to do it and not be afraid. So I'm really excited that we met in person and I love your mom. Oh Your yes, mom is so she has sweet. been taping us the whole time. How's it going? I love Mrs. Winter. Thank you. Thanks for being in the club. Yes, okay, you. let's talk to your channel. Okay, my channel is Business and Travel. You've actually helped me create my playlist for YouTube, and you did a couple audits for me too. So thank you. So oh much. yay! Do you want to say something? I am so happy to be here and to have met Shanae in person. It's just so good to see like e-bosses and like to hear you guys say the impact that I've had on your lives. It's just so, it's, it, it makes me over the moon to meet you in person. Absolutely. I mean, you helped me feel inspired and encouraged. So. I'm so excited for you to be here. Thank you. Thank you. Well, I hope you enjoy the rest of the conference. I hope I did good too. Yes, you did phenomenal. Oh, Everybody good. love vlogging. Vlogging is my favorite thing. Too. Really? More than sit down because I feel so stiff. Yeah. So I love vlogging. Oh, so I'm here for it. Okay, I'm I'll see you guys around. Okay, yeah, we'll see. You. Thank you. <laughs> what was your takeaway from the morning? Oh my gosh. There was, first of all, there was so much information. Yeah. Back to back, my, I feel like stuff is about to start spilling out of my ears. Yeah. I think Vanessa Lau stands out. She gave so many really tangible tips on navigating content creation from where you are. And I yeah. think that was big. That like, was big for me too. Recently, the audience on the live was like, we want to see more of you. Like, you guys. So I did, here's a, a day in my life in Mexico City. And I actually left the house to go to a cafe to work. I and think like, I saw that one. It has been gaining a lot of traction. That was good. I liked it. I love vlogs, though. The, I mean, the views did, yeah. it did fairly, like, a lot better than some of the other recent videos. So yeah. I'm like, oh, y'all do? I'm one of those people who love vlogs. Yeah. All right. To quote the famous philosopher Drake, we started from the bottom, <laughs> now we are here. Um, <laughs> For the one troll whose name is Minecraft62, and he's 15 on your channel, on your business channel, and I don't know why you care about what he's saying, and he goes, oh, that wasn't new, I knew that. You are, you're not making your content for Minecraft63. You're making your content for someone who's just discovering you for the first time. Start with who, master the art of the hook, use your power words in your titles and social media captions, and you will get more attention and it'll help you build your influence and income. Thank you. Because your grandkids are hoping you produce content so they can study you when you're no longer here with us. It's the end of day one. Let's put together a game plan. Let's put together our moves. Number one, spend time getting clear on the vision. If I wanted to be an actor, here's what I would do. 
Notice how Adam Sandler makes movies with the same five guys over and over and over again, okay? Notice how Vince Vaughn and Owen Wilson, how many times they did the same thing. Notice how Bradley Cooper and Jennifer Lawrence keep going. Notice how people that started making movies, John Favreau and Vince Vaughn, how many guys seen Swingers? They keep doing things together. This is the point. If you're at the beginning and you don't have a lot of resources, pick three to five people that also want to create content and then collaborate with the technology you buy together. I'll put 500, you put 500, let's buy a few things together and then let's use it. You have to come through on that vision and the dream. If you just say it and it's lip service, everybody will realize it. If I want to get to the next level, I have to meet a new PVD, new version of myself. I think everybody is probably humbled by their, by their own experience. Because at the end of the day, we all start with zero. I haven't had a bagel in so long. Our morning session is about to start. We have some breakfast left on the terrace. And we have free books available for get, people getting in the room before 8 a.m. What time is it now? 7.35. Mm. Our first session starts at 8. I'm not sure what it's about yet, but it's going to be amazing. I already know. <laughs> Rise and grind. It's a new day full of new opportunities and new possibilities. Let's crush. Imagine you're talking to a guy. You don't know anything. He's just like talking about business. And you're like, oh, that's cool. And then like two seconds later, it's like, dude, that guy's a billionaire. All of a sudden, you're like... <laughs> Right? The frame matters. You gotta do it a lot of times, for a long period of time, and you will get better. That is a promise. You will, if you suck today, you will suck less tomorrow. And eventually, one day you will look up and suck so little that you will actually be good. And then people will ask you, how did you become an overnight success? And then instead of saying, here's how you cold call, you say, here's how I did it. I hope this serves you. We just heard from Alex Hermosi. The takeaway from his session was do stuff, talk about it, and then do it bigger. Another thing that stood out from his session was communicating from the I statement versus the you statement. I can only speak from my own experiences, and I can only share knowledge, resources, and information about what I have done personally versus telling people how they should do things. Hello world, my name is Shanae Braxton and I'm here at the Grow With Video Live conference because I love video, I love sharing travel stories, real video content, and the Think Media team has been a phenomenal educator for me on this journey as I try to grow my YouTube channel. That's the reason why I'm a content creator. That's the reason why I'm a traveler. It's because I seek local experiences. I travel the world to learn about cultures, to learn about languages, to learn about food, to learn about how someone else lives day to day. There's a ton of marketplaces. Basically, you can Google like creator marketplaces and list yourself there. Um, but the reality is, is like brands aren't going to come to you. This isn't Tinder, they're not going to just like start swiping right on you. Right? The reality is you're going to have to go out there and find them. And by using brands' products, you can reach out to them and create those relationships, create those deals. One-off posts do not work. Ever. Ever. When I mean ever, I mean ever. If a brand comes to us and asks for a one-off post, I won't take it because it's not going to work for them and I'm not going to get to keep them as a client. You already have what you need. You just got to show up at the table and lean in and uh, and share with them what you provide for them. My aha moment was uh, from John Bevere said things that will cause your calling to go dormant is fear and intimidation. I refuse to not let both of those things to cause my calling to go dormant. Come on, let's give it up. No fear, no intimidation. We're going to be bold. We're going to be courageous. Um, I'm Keisha. I'm local here in Vegas. My biggest aha moment is the speakers and Sean and everyone that's putting this together were just like us at one point in their life, mm. sitting in the same seat you're sitting. Just remember, they were just getting started just like we all are now, and the sky's the limit. Raise your hand here if you are a solo creator. You have no one else on your team. It's just you. Okay, raise your hand if you have over, uh, if you have up to five employees on your team. Got it? No? Okay, I'll explain because I'm glad some of you said no. So think about when you're watching TV and you're watching, like, you're watching that show and just before commercial, they show you a little scene of somebody slapping somebody else and you're like, oh! So you know that there was a slap, but you, there's a lot of information you don't know, so you are curious. curious. I, as an African American, can build something, learn something, come back, go back to the community where I was from, oh, yeah. and employ those kind of people. <laughs> My YouTube budget for this year has already surpassed 
seven figures, but solely just from growing with video. I want to learn what can I do better? How can I help more people? How can I serve more people? How can I employ more people? And there are six C's that God gave me that has helped me to build the business that we're, we are building. Here's the very first C, character. Gary Vaynerchuk. Gary Vaynerchuk. Gary V. Gary V. Thank you, see ya. <laughs> the micro is simple, I'll tell you why. Because no matter what platform you're making on, best practices exist, right? Like, if you want to be better at it, like, YouTube and TikTok have unlimited content of best practices for YouTube and TikTok scattered all over. It's just not the game. The game is, are you comfortable in how you make? Do you have a process to make? A lot of you... For example, if you think of, when I think about my career, I very quickly was like, oh my God, this YouTube thing in December of 2005, I was like, this thing's gonna change the world. I had those thoughts, but I was like, the thing I know the best at this point in my life is wine. So let me make wine videos and let me make them my way. And it's fun for me to think back that the advice I'm giving right now in 2022 is exactly what I lived 16 years ago when I first entered the arena. I'm telling you, a lot of you are making videos around genres where you think there's money versus making videos around the stuff you like and know, which will then lead to the money. I really, really believe that. I think a lot more of you should be making very niche content around stuff you have passion around because then you will have the, everyone's like, how do you have so much energy? I'm like, I love this shit. But if you're making content around something that you heard has good ad sense or there's good brand deals in or that's where the money is, you're fucking finished because it's not you. You need to fucking really lean into who you are as a communicator. Please listen to me. Let the world catch up to you. People are scared to be themselves when being yourself is the only moat in life. This, what do you make? How do you make it? Do you like it? That's the fucking game. And so I will preach this in perpetuity because it is so crystal clear. You can't sustain doing something you don't like. I hope that you all enjoyed attending the Grow With Video Live conference. I had an amazing time. I met some phenomenal people and I'm super excited to connect with them after the conference and put into action what we learned in these past two days. So I'm excited and I will see you all in the next video. Until next time, bye.